try my Chennai guy. Because I look like a Chennai guy. <laughs> because nobody will believe me if I say I'm a Punjabi. <laughs> hey, my name is Manpreet Singh. No, it won't work. <laughs> I was born and brought up in Chennai, which means that I studied engineering. <laughs> How many engineers here? Hands down, no placement. <laughs> but India is a land of engineers. Engineers are everywhere. There are three engineers in my family alone because my father has only three children. <laughs> my parents gave me one career option, engineering, I studied. But my friend, he was so lucky, his parents gave him three options. Electronics engineering, mechanical engineering, computer science engineering. See, I'm not against engineering, okay? It's a very good branch of science. You can learn a lot of things. Actually, I recommend engineering as a career. But my problem is, where do we study? Not everybody studies in IIT, right? Anybody from IIT? See? <laughs> IIT people have better plans on a Saturday evening. <laughs> they do productive things and become Google CEO and all. Right? See, that's my problem. And the other problem studying engineering in India, whatever branch of engineering you study, only a software company will recruit you. <laughs> I'll tell you what happens in a campus interview, final year interview. All final year students will be here. All IT companies will be here. They will welcome them. Come guys, come, come, come. Sir, mechanical, ah, it's okay, da, come. <laughs> Sir, chemical, yeah, it ends with engineering, no? <laughs> Get in. They will hire you, irrespective of the background. And they will train you in everything. C, C++, Java, Oracle, .NET, Butterscotch, Vanilla, Strawberry. <laughs> After all the trainings, you will get into a project. There, your manager will ask you to work in Excel sheet. <laughs> How do I know? Because I was a software engineer. I used to work for this company called Cognizant, CTS. My mother was very proud. Whenever she introduced me to someone, she always says, my son Manoj, software engineer working in CTS office. But the reality is, I am a software engineer working in MS office. <laughs> All those Word document, Excel sheet, PowerPoint. Wait, I know I never worked in PowerPoint because PowerPoint is for HR people. <laughs> for every meeting, they'll come up with a PowerPoint presentation which will have four slides. Out of the four, three is welcome agenda, thank you. <laughs> Fourth one is prepare the way. Because it is very important to protect your slides, otherwise someone will copy your welcome agenda, thank you slide. And whenever I say that I'm a software engineer to someone, they will ask me this question. Manoj, software engineer, when are you going to on-site? And they will compare me with others. Say, that guy is going, why you are not going? Are you impotent? <laughs> where, where did this come from? <laughs> Maybe if I continue to work like this for 12 hours a day without a break, I might become one, but I... No, no, I mean, are you not important like that guy? <laughs> First of all, those who ask me this question, they should understand what is on-site. What is on-site? If you work for a US client, they'll send you to USA. If you work for a UK client, they'll send you to UK. I was working for an Indian client. <laughs> for your kind information, I am already at on-site only. <laughs> when are you going to on-site? Everybody are asking me this. Everybody except my manager. <laughs> this is when I really get irritated when the HR people, when they recruit you, this is what they say. Sir, passport is the most important joining document. <laughs> Without that, you are not getting this job. Really? It's been six years. My passport has never met a printer in its life. It is as single as me lying in one corner of the room. Never getting touched, just like me. Nowadays, out of guilt, I started using my passport as address proof. Using my passport, I got my Aadhaar card. And I linked both of them. I know it's not needed, but that way I am happy. At least my passport is linked to something. <laughs> I got my passport using my driving license. I got my driving license using my ration card. Now, I have four address proofs. For one address. Which is a rented one. Because I never went to on-site. <laughs>